December 18th is International Migrants Day. Dozens of overseas migrant workers gathered at the Manila Economic and Cultural Office to protest, asking the Philippines government to pay attention to their rights. They submitted a petition and were surprised when the Philippines representative accepted the letter but did not talk to them at all and just left to booing. Dozens of Filipino workers gathered at the Manila Economic and Cultural Office to protest, hoping to bring long-term unreasonable treatment of overseas Philippines workers to the Philippine government's attention. Their main issue is to ask the Philippine government to stop the certification of labor contract wages, which undercut minimum wages. Wang Ingda, director of the Serve the People Association SPA in Taoyuan City, pointed out that labor contracts stipulate that accommodation and lodging should be provided free of charge. However, in the Chinese version, these weren't included, although the English version gave 4,000 NT dollars for these. They wanted to know why the Philippines government had given the official certification to the documents when there were contradictions. They also hoped that the MECO office could open on Saturdays and Sundays to help manage exploitative high-interest loan companies and other issues. Protesters hoped that the Philippine government would take their worries seriously. They were angry when the official representative only appeared to take the petition and then left straight away, causing jeers. Wang criticized the Philippine government's arrogant attitude, saying it should attach importance to overseas Philippines workers. He also called attention to the exploitation of Philippine fishermen.